Connor Sampson is a homegrown, I'm going to say it, I'm going to call it homegrown talent here in CCW, one of our top rising stars right now. We, if you caught the Scott Lee Crew promo from a little bit earlier in the night, you know that he's been talking a little bit. He's, he has some things that he wants to make up for that came out of his past. Uh, part of him and his brother, a tag team that was affiliated with Scott Lee Crew during the middle of Scott Lee's championship run. But Hunter Sampson deciding to go into business for himself to do the right thing and stop supporting that nefarious title reign of uh, Scott Lee Crew. Since then, we've seen a lot of power and a lot of ability coming out of horsepower Hunter Sampson, but he has got his work cut out for him tonight with the returning Hollywood Cole. This is a former contender for the NBWA heavyweight title, a man polarizing as he is charismatic. I have to tell you, I never really uh, fully understood why he calls himself Hollywood Cole. We know that uh, originally from the Lincoln area outside here of Fredericton, now residing in Hollywood, California. But I don't, I don't think he's been in any movies. I think at most he's been in a couple of uh, small-time commercials. But, you know, to each their own right now, Hollywood Cole. A very accomplished in the ring, had some spectacular matches here in CCW before. It is absolutely fantastic to see him back in action. Trained by Lance Storm, which uh, we'll, you're going to hear that a lot tonight as we have several wrestlers on the roster representing the Lance Storm Academy. And Hollywood Cole, known for his sort of a, sort of a neck breaker, face buster combo move called the Final Cut. So I'm going to be keeping my eyes peeled, staying ready to see that move in action. Horsepower Hunter Sampson uh, coming in with a size and a weight advantage. Hunter Sampson coming in 6'2", 225. Hollywood Cole, not too far off in the six-foot range, but a little bit leaner, a little bit meaner. He's going to be coming in at 185 pounds. Hollywood Cole has not been with us for a while, so he has taken a moment just to spend a little bit of time with the CCW fans. I, they are not happy to hear, to see him. They remember, they remember everything that happened with Hollywood Cole. going to be horsepower Hunter Sampson in the green and white Hollywood Cole in the hot pink and uh, some kind of zebra print <laughs> Referee in our contest will be referee Alex This one is going to be underway. So horsepower, there's a reason they call him that because he's got a lot of speed, he's got a lot of power coming in. Uh, last month we saw an amazing effort uh, between uh, him and Kirk Obey for the River Valley title. <laughs> Two young bucks here giving each other a little bit of space, trying to get the crowd on their side. I think that speaks for itself. Hollywood Cole is going to need to head on down to Haley's Pawn Shop and pick himself up some cheers. Hunter Sampson, quite a few, quite a few for himself right there. Maybe you can spot Hollywood Cole some. Oh, and now Hollywood Cole's asking for a handshake. I'm sure nothing bad's going to happen there. I don't know if, uh, what are the odds that Hunter Sampson doesn't watch wrestling? Uh, although if you're ready for it, it can work out to your advantage, though. If he doesn't, but no, he goes to the audience uh, looking for some feedback. Uh, but apparently Hollywood Cole is like, that's the opportunity he was waiting for. And he's coming right in, laying the boots to Hunter Sampson right there, arguing with the referee about how many kicks that was and how much time that he was allowed to take it. 
just absolutely infuriating everybody in here. Now he's already he's already got him on the ropes, choking him right now, and you fully utilizing that count. Hollywood Cole does not want to lose his big comeback match here right now. Stiff, stiff chop. You see him here. Looks like he hurt his hand a little bit. Um, but at this point in the match, Hunter Sampson is fresh as a daisy. He's going to be coming back. He's just going to make him mad. And here we got the massive clothesline. Massive clothesline coming in here right now. Duck under. He sets him up. Big old back body drop coming in from Hunter Sampson. Uh, kicking him, booting him all the way out of the ring. And Hollywood Cole has is feeling that size advantage. Taking a little bit of a walk. Now, last month I fully supported Hunter Sampson taking a moment when he baited Kirk Obey out of the ring. Uh, this is not the case here tonight. Hollywood Cole took himself out of the ring because he's trying to build up a little bit of steam for a comeback. Hunter Sampson, uh, well, matches are won inside the ring, but now he's finally decided to go out. He's trying to get, he's trying to sneak up on Hollywood Cole. Chasing him around there. You gotta watch. There's gonna be an elbow. Dodges the elbow. Got him scouted right there. Way to go. Hunter Sampson hits it. Sends Hollywood Cole off. We got a duck under from Hollywood Cole. Scoops him up for a sidewalk slam. And down. There was some authority on that thing, too. He's gonna get a two count, two and some change uh, right now for the exchange. But he's got Hollywood Cole right where he wants him there, back in the ring. And he's grabbed, Hollywood's grabbed the referee. And Hunter Sampson. Oh, getting poked in the eye, just Hollywood Cole, he will not lose this match. He, this is his big comeback, and he knows he's got his work cut out for him with this up-and-coming CCW talent. He's coming in. I think he took a little too long there. Yeah, that's not going to do the job. Utilizing the ropes a little bit, taking advantage of the space. The crowd trying to get a little Hunter Sampson chance started right there. Didn't really take off. Uh, they know Hollywood Cole's got him down right now. But those cheers that he was getting at the start of this match, he could really use a few of them to come back right now. Getting a, Is it possible there were some eyes on the rope right there? Possibly a bloody nose on Hunter Sampson, not 100%. Hard to tell with the shadows, and he cuts him off with the kitchen sink. Throws the knee in. He's keeping him grounded right now. There are very few superstars in the locker room that can build up momentum like Sampson uh, when he gets flying around. He's got just the right amount of size and just the right amount of speed to complement it. So Hollywood Cole slowing the match down, trying to get some damage in, something definitive, something that's going to demoralize Hunter Sampson, make him want to stop fighting, make him start thinking about getting home. Scoops a neck breaker right there. You can see those fingertips deep. Uh, I think it might have been one in the nose, one in the eye on Hunter Sampson. What is Hollywood Cole thinking right now? Scoops him. Big release suplex. A little close to the ropes. That's more of a threat when you're fighting a veteran wrestler. He had everything scooped, everything locked in appropriately. Hell of a counter there. Now he's choking him. Uh, referee Alex might think about getting in there. Um, I don't know. Hollywood Cole's running out of moves, but he's starting to look a little bit desperate. He's, he's choking him with the leg, but it's right in front of the referee right now. He's trying. I don't know. He's trying to hold his eye contact, but he's trying to hypnotize him like Jafar or something. Puts him back into the corner. Come on. We're looking for a reversal. Hunter Sands has been known to explode out of the corners when he gets thrown in like that. Oh, he's going high. Is he going for that? He's going for a top rope clothesline. That's an upgrade. Last month, I believe we had a second rope clothesline. Now he's taking it up a notch. Took him a little higher to get up there, but he's coming in with a little bit more speed and a little bit more damage. Asking for a little bit of crowd support. Not sure if he's tuning up the band or he's just trying to start a clap. 
He's coming in close. Not sure what he's thinking. Hunter Sampson finishing maneuvers very similar to a black hole slam. Sling blade. That will turn it around fast right there. And it looks like Hollywood Cole is taking his place back on top right now. Hits that sling blade. Kind of takes his time getting back in. For someone who was taking such desperate tactics earlier in this match, um, Hunter Sampson was making a comeback right there. He cut him off with the sling blade. He's got to stay on top of him. He's got to, he's got to use his speed. Hunter Sampson is a fast individual, a fast athlete, but Hollywood Cole could be a little bit faster. He's directing attacks. He's trying to destroy the base of support of Sampson, working the knees, lots of stomps, lots of kicks. He went after the lungs at first. It looks like he changed his strategy. Now he's going to be working the lower body. Comes flying in, little splash, little stinger splash out of Hollywood Cole and a neck breaker. Classic neck breaker delivered. And it looks like it's only going to be a two. Not a lot of movement out of Hunter Sampson right now. So it looks like Hollywood Cole, incensed perhaps by that top rope aerial assault from Hunter Sampson, he's going to go up. He's trying something of his own, but he is taking way too long to get up there. See, Hunter Sampson's starting to roll. He's starting to move, get a little bit of life back. He probably has felt, yeah, Cole going up top. And he very savvy, very wisely hits that top rope, knocking Hollywood Cole down. We could get a superplex right here. Hollywood. How high are the lights in this place? <laughs> oh. Both men paying the iron price right there on the landing. Uh, Hunter Sampson fully in the middle of the ring. Cole's rolled over. One of these guys has got to get over for a pin. Referee Alex is starting to count right now. Because both men, they're lying there. They're completely motionless. We got to hear some chants here. We got to hear, we got to fire these guys up if we want to have a winner over here. And I do not want another. Hollywood. DQ. We got some Hollywood fans, I think, um, in the back over here. Definitely a lot of Hunter Sampson fans as well. This count, it's going up. I don't know. They got to crawl. Someone's got to do something. At this point, someone's got to get up onto their feet. Looks like we're going to have another knockdown, drag out, punch battle. Shades of Chris Charter's Jason Boa. Men trying to fight their way back up onto the feet. Referee Alex wisely stops the count. Seeing that both men were, uh, were starting to slug it out. Stiff hit. Land. Hunter Sampson just landing these right on the chin. I got to give it to Hollywood Cole. I'm starting to feel bad after a couple of those hits. He's setting them up for something. It's that hard shoulder on shoulder clothesline right now. Falls it up, splashes him right into the corner. Cole trying to find some safe space, but there is no quarter being given by Hunter Sampson. He sets him up again. He's taking him post to post. You see the ring shake uh, just from that hit right there. Cole stumbles out forward, not sure where to go. Huge impact right there. Hunter Sampson, he comes in for the pin. This could be it right here. He's got the leg hooked. He's not going to be able to get to the ropes. Hollywood Cole somehow kicking out right now, kicking out at two and three quarters and an eighth. I was never any good at fractions. I don't know if that adds up to three or not, but okay. Hunter Sampson, he's pounding the turnbuckle. He's looking for the finish right now. Uh, it's very similar to a black hole slam. He's coming in. Scott Lee Crew coming up on the side of the apron, making the distraction right there because he had called out Hunter Sampson earlier in the night. Hollywood Cole's going to roll him up right now. Scott Lee Crew right there, and he gets the spin on the ropes. And the momentum of Hunter Sampson has been cut off by Hollywood Cole and Scott Lee Crew. That is a damn shame right there. The roof is blowing off this place. They hate Scott Lee Crew, and I think they have refound their hatred of Hollywood Cole for that one because this is one of the Hunter Sampson is one of the top rising stars here in CCW, and he just got robbed. And all he did was the right thing. When he decided to stop working with Scott Lee Crew, it was the right thing to do.
Yeah, take your moment, Hollywood Cole. Very, very well earned. This is absolutely unbelievable travesty of justice. All that Hunter Sampson did when he stopped working with Scott Lee Crew was do the right thing. And now he's paid the price. This crowd, they hate Scott Lee Crew. They hate everything that he represents, and they just refound their hatred of Hollywood Cole. Uh, unbelievable, absolutely unbelievable, but a hell of an effort right there. I know we're going to see great things in the future out of Hunter Sampson.